um, went to school on the on the west side of Manhattan. BS 94, Blessed Sacrament, Powell Memorial, City College, all over. Okay, and yeah, this is where growing up, going up. Um, now we get into. Looks like it's a good place. I had a church dance uh, many, many years ago. And um, uh, my wife was in high school, I was in high school. And, um, you know, um, you got maybe it's luck, timing. moved up from, at that time, 70th Street, we just married it a year or so, and moved in here. Um, uh, Tobias Heller owned the building at that time, and he had bought that, the building from Metropolitan Life. The building was put up in 1913, uh, it was built on the Strauss family uh, home, summer home, and um, I have pictures of it. It's really, it's, it's a beautifully laid out building. <laughs> My first day, I think, to be a bus driver. Well, the only one who had jobs uh, during the Depression years. Uh, I'm a sports buff. I played a little minor league baseball. I got fired, though. It only took three weeks. <laughs> they got rid of me. <laughs> uh, simple thing. I couldn't get the ball over the plate that well. <laughs> then after a while, I got interested in being maybe an engineer maybe an engineer. And I spent about over 30 years in Marbell, uh, and uh, it was good, I enjoy. I look forward to going to work every day. So. Okay, Truman was leaving the White House, and he drove back, he and his wife, that's drove back to Independence. One of the reporters asked to him, Mr. President, you achieved so much, you, you wind up being the most powerful job in the world. Is there anything else in life you inspired to be? Truman thought for a minute, said, yes. I would love to be a piano player, in a whorehouse. There is no difference. <laughs>